Here I am arriving at Wellington Airport, which seems a little odd I guess, given that this is an episode about travel to Canberra. The reality is though, for many business travellers who make the trip across the ditch weekly or even more frequently, sometimes home really is the best destination of all. The new Trans-Tasman alliance between Air New Zealand and Virgin Australia will create the most extensive Australasian route network ever, connecting Air New Zealand's 27 domestic destinations with 29 Australian ports, streamlining business travel and getting you where you need to be and home quicker than ever before. In November, the brand new Trans-Tasman Alliance schedule comes into play. With the new flight times, it will even be possible, if you're in a real hurry, to fly to Canberra in the morning for a quick meeting, then end up back here at Wellington by midnight. The new schedule will mean at least 10 flights a day will conveniently connect Wellington, Auckland and Christchurch to Canberra via either Sydney or Melbourne. I left Wellington yesterday at 6.45am, arriving at Parliament House in Canberra just after lunch allowing me plenty of time for an afternoon walking the corridors of power. I took an Air New Zealand flight from Wellington to Sydney and flew Virgin Australia on the Canberra leg. I booked the whole trip on the Air New Zealand website as a work sphere, which meant I was entitled to the same benefits on Virgin Australia as I would get travelling works on Air New Zealand. Virgin is currently refurbishing its fleet and the aircraft I was on from Sydney to Canberra didn't have in-flight entertainment. I was pleasantly surprised that I did get food though, even though the flight time was only 25 minutes. Virgin Australia has food available for certain fare types or to purchase on every domestic flight in Australia, no matter how short. The works fare entitled me to a checked bag on each leg. As a quarter club member, I could have taken an extra bag on both the Air New Zealand and Virgin Australia flights if I needed to. Connecting to my domestic flight was really straightforward. I cleared customs in Sydney, then checked back in at the domestic connections desk and jumped on the free bus to the domestic terminal. Virgin has a swanky lounge in Sydney which Air New Zealand Gold Elite, Gold and Kuru members are entitled to use, so Air New Zealand passengers now have somewhere to go while waiting for domestic flights, to read the day's papers and get the latest business or sports news and prep for meetings. Of course my short stay in Canberra was not all tough grind, while you've been working I've been checking out the sites. Australia's capital is home to the National Portrait Gallery, the National Botanic Gardens, the National Library and the National Museum of Australia. I'm sure they're all very nice. You may be surprised to know there are also more than 30 wineries within 35 minutes of the city. With so much going on, you may want to stay on after all.